Hey guys, we just had the log lift attempts between Luke Stockman and Rob Kearney, part of the World Ultimate Strongman Feats of Strength series. This is episode five, there's one more to come. I was excited for this one. Log lift for, for Max is always uh, a lift that gets people excited and the, the possibility of a new world record with, with Luke getting so close in season one. So join us there, refereeing, always worried about his record going these days. I think the guys are getting closer and closer. Unfortunately, a little bit of sad news to start with. Rob Kearney going for the American record. He was trying to take his American record up by almost 10 pounds. He was attempting 484 pounds, 220 kilos. He had a first attempt, got pretty close, couldn't quite, with his split jerk technique, it really needs to either go or, or it tends not to happen at all. He, he couldn't quite get it high enough to get his head through and, and get under the, the log. Came back for a second attempt, and unfortunately, it looks like he's torn his tricep. Really, really devastating for Rob. Unfortunately, these things happen in Strongman. He's such a, a tough, mental, mentally strong character. I know he's going to be back, but without question, he's going to be massively devastated and disappointed right now. But we send him our best wishes. Rob is a, is a good friend of so many of the strongmen, and I know from experience what it's like to, to suffer with those injuries. He's no doubt going to go home. He's going to bury his head in some ice cream. He'll be disappointed for tonight, and then tomorrow he's going to wake up, start focusing on what he needs to do to get the, the tricep fixed and plan his comeback. But without question, Rob will be back, and he'll be getting that record at some point next year. Now, Luke Stoltman has been pretty quiet about his log lifting in training recently, and I really wasn't sure what to expect, especially it's not really been that long since his first at attempt at this world record. So first time round, he went straight for the record as well during his warm-ups. And uh, for those that don't know, a few weeks back, Graham Hicks took the British record up to 220 kilos. And as good friends as these guys are, there's that friendly rivalry as everyone wants to prove that they are the best in their nation. Um, and Hicksy has been claiming that he's the strongest presser and it's something Luke is, is kind of proud to, to try and claim for himself and he wanted an attempt at that today. So, how did he get on? First attempt with Luke, 190 kilos. Now bear in mind, 190 kilos not that long ago was what I held as the British record. He's using it as a warm-up and he made it look extremely easy. One thing with Luke is his, his technique is absolutely spot on. Perfect, clean of the log. He keeps in position. He keeps the log nice and high up on the clavicle. And then lots of leg power to, in the drive. Lots of shoulder and tricep power to finish the rep off. And he made 190 look effortless. His next attempt, or his first proper attempt, was 211 kilos. Now, if I'm honest, this wasn't as good as I was expecting. For when I was comparing his lifts from first time round uh, compared to today's lifts, it wasn't as good. Technically, it didn't quite look as good as well. It may be the log just came away from him slightly, and it's these little tiny factors that make a difference with these huge weights. So after seeing that, I didn't even think he was going to have a, a crack at the, the British record. How wrong I was. He came back with 221 kilos and he was fired up. You don't often see this from Luke. He was so pumped up for this, really letting his emotions kind of out. He, he, he lifted the log absolutely brilliant. It was such a beautiful lift. Got the down from Zadrunas and he just let out the emotion. <laughs> he, you could see how much it meant to him and it's one of the reasons I love watching Luke he just lets us in to that personality he, you know he celebrated and it was, a, it was a big big lift for him he wanted to prove he's the best log lifter in the UK right now I know a certain Mr Hicksy will be back to, to challenge him those two are going to keep pushing this British record and I believe the world record up and up and up the world record though wasn't to be for Luke today he came back and he said himself, I mean, a couple of things he said in the interview afterwards, and it was a few things I picked up on before or even the attempt. Firstly, probably too close to the attempt last time round. And with World's Strongest Man in the background, I believe that will kind of have been his main focus. And on top of that, he had to cope with his seeing his friend Rob. They're, they're, they're competing at the same time. They could see each other through the videos. Unfortunately, hearing the bad news about Rob, just before you've got to go and lift a world record, it's not ideal. And unfortunately, 
he didn't really get that close this time around. I think he, he put everything into the British record. It was such a good lift. Like I said, I wasn't so convinced with the lift before at 211 kilos, but the 221 was just a beautiful lift. And I think he just put everything into that. And to be quite honest, I think it was a smart thing to do. First time round where he, he kind of just went from the world record and he, he did, he got so close, but he missed out on the British record with his number selection. So this is actually the first time that Luke has been recognized as the British record holder holder in the log lift. So the record still stands at 228 kilos, just over 500 pounds, 501 pounds I believe, held by Zadrinus Viscus. I am very happy. Zadrinus has kind of put out the feelers there that he may want to attempt this record again. And again, he's another one that's attempted to break this record a number of times as well. So I don't know who's going to be the man to get it. We're getting closer and closer. You've got the likes of Iron Bibby once he's back. You know, he's, he's been quiet recently. It's going to be interesting to see what kind of shape he's in. You've got Graham Hicks. You've got Luke Stockman. You've got, you know, a number of great up-and-comers. There's, there's lots of big pressers out there. But Zadrunas is still the man when it comes to the log lift. For how much longer? I don't know. But make sure you guys tune in next week as we have two men attempting the world record in the deadlift for Max. And these guys only have the deadlift to focus on. They're not competing at World's Strongest Man. So it's going to be very, very interesting to see how they get on. Even Makarov has kind of put out that he believes he's one of the absolute greatest deadlifters of all time. He's talked about ridiculous numbers. 520 kilos has been mentioned. The world record stands at 501. The only two men to ever go above 500 in a, a recognized competition or, or, or lift have been the incredible Eddie Hall and Hafthor Julius Bjornsson. Two of the best of all time to do this. Can even Makarov put his name in with those guys or will Rauner Heinler surprise everyone? We also next week have Misha Shivlikov going for the Masters record. Masters meaning over 40. So the record stands at 435 kilos. Can he take that up? He got close last time. He believes he's in better shape this time. We'll find out. I'll be back next week. Guys, let me know what you thought of the lifting today. I'll see you soon. While you're here, guys, subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my awesome strength content.